Welcome to the Common Man Football Show. My name is James Coburn, and today's episode, uh, we're talking about Florida State edge rusher Brian Burns in terms of his analytics profile. Um, as you guys may already know, if you have been watching this channel from the very beginning, uh, I made a video about Brian Burns in terms of his production data. I said that I would be doing a full analytics review once all this information came in, and this is that review. So if you're new to the channel and new to the work that I do, uh, you can go to the description and get all the sort of terms and definitions there. Now let's get to his profile. So first off, if you've seen the production video, you should already know this, but again, Brian Burns has a great production profile, 77 in terms of solo tackle data, 90.70 in terms of sack data, and uh, you know high 90s as well in terms of tackle for loss data, pretty much hits uh, the all-pro thresholds except for solo tackle, but does hit the Pro Bowl thresholds. And when you look at his the averages at the position, he definitely hits within the Pro Bowl averages and uh, pretty close to the all-pro averages as well in terms of his production profile. So great production. Pro, he's pretty much a, a fringe all-pro to Pro Bowl type player. You know, he pretty much is well in the Pro Bowl area, but more of a fringe all-pro player, but still great production. You know, great sack data, great TFL data in terms of his market share data. Uh, and we to look at his athleticism. Uh, he had a 71.82 explosion score, 90.04 speed score, and 80.55 flexibility score. Uh, again, another area where he's fantastic, pretty much hits uh, all the all-pro thresholds, all the Pro Bowl thresholds in terms of athleticism for his size. Uh, and when you look at the averages of the position, his speed and flexibility definitely hit within the Pro Bowl averages uh, for the most part, uh, with the exception of ex explosion data. Most all-pro and Pro Bowl edges usually have about 79 to 80 in terms of their athleticism, but in terms of explosion but this is still a good athletic profile guys like this is a really good profile in terms of athleticism uh, for his size uh, when it comes to production comps so again this is another thing I'm doing this year uh, because uh, you know I, I want and again this is not a direct comparison so just because I say that he has similar production to this guy that doesn't mean that he is this guy it's just to give you a sort of range of, of like these are guys who tested similarly you know, these are guys who tested very similar to him, is all this really does. But in terms of a production comp, it's Demarcus Lawrence, uh, you know, the edge from uh, Boise State, uh, who also is on the Dallas Cowboys. This, you know, he, you know, he was a Dallas Cowboy, of course. Um, and the difference between Lawrence and Brian Burns, honestly, is Brian Burns is just a better athlete. <laughs> so I think this is a pretty spot on comparison just because. Lawrence was also sort of an undersized uh, sort of edge guy. Uh, and uh, that's the same thing Brian Burns is, except Burns, of course, is more athletic. And on top of that, Burns put up this type of production at Florida State, whereas Lawrence did this at Boise State. So Brian Burns is the superior Demarcus Lawrence, essentially, in terms of his production profile. Uh, and when you look at athleticism comps, uh, the guy who really sticks out the most as a comp for him is Ebenezer. Uh, Ekubon, um, that is sort of the comparison there. You know, similar product, similar athleticism pattern, I should say. Uh, you know, uh, explosion is in the 70 range, high speed score, a high tackle for loss, a high uh, flexibility score, excuse me, uh, but uh, not elite, but definitely high. So Ebenezer Ekubon is kind of the 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 uh, athleticism comp for Burns, but. Bottom line, this is a great profile. You know, this is someone that should be considered a first-round pick. Uh, this is someone that can go on to become a Pro Bowl edge very easily at the next level. And I'm very excited to see what he does with his career because, uh, you know, these are great numbers, you know, for a guy like this. Um, he's someone who definitely had to deal with a lot of troubles at Florida State because of the losing. But I think that if he goes to the right team, I mean, he's someone who I think should go to a team that actually has a winning culture in place uh, that has a lot of positives for him. So very excited about Brian Burns, as you should be as well. And of course, so my name is James Coburn. You can find my other work at draftcoburn.wordpress.com. You can also follow me on Twitter at Geometrics. And if you like this content and you want more content like this, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Uh, share this video as well with anybody that you know. Hit that notification bell in case you want to be reminded when another video of mine drops. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Peace. Bye.